really my worst nightmare. Um, yeah, so I'm Molly, I read the news on 210FM. So I'm not a comedian, I read the news on 210FM. I don't pretend to be funny. So what I've done is uh, spoken to a load of real comedians who have given me a load of gags that apparently are funny. So I'm just going to read them out. If you find them funny, brilliant. If you don't, it's not my fault. David O'Doherty told me that um, this one was funny. Who are the most decent people at the hospital? Sir, with the glasses. Who are the most decent people at the hospital? No idea. Who are the most decent people? The ultrasound people. Oh. Oh, come on. Another guy, I'll tell you who it was after, he told me that the weather in Manchester is very like the Muslims in Iraq. It's a bit edgy, this one. The weather in Manchester is very like the Muslims in Iraq. It's either sunny or it's Shiite. <laughs> that was Jason Manford, by the way. If you didn't like it, he's already been here, so you've not missed anything. Uh, anyway, why does a Mexican throw his wife off a cliff? Tequila! Yeah, you got it! That one! The one! Oh no, that was the guy with the grey hair and the glasses has been waving all night! Yay! Yay! He's loving it all night! Oh, I love it. What's your name, sir, by the way? What's your name? We never find out your name. Tom Goodliff's dad. Tom Goodliff. I'm the one with the balloons. So, Tom Goodliff. Yeah. Tom Goodliff Stafford. No. His father. No. Tom Goodliff's dad. Good old Tom Goodliff, he's got a brilliant dad. Right, Paddy McGuinness. I don't know if any of you are fans of Paddy McGuinness. So, pa Do you know who Paddy McGuinness is? He's, he's um, Peter Kay's mate. Peter Kay, the funny one. Um, anyway, he told me these two. You know him? Yes, I am. You're Betty mates. Don't worry about it. You're Betty mates? Are you? <laughs> really? <laughs> How do you know him? <laughs> yeah, but Paddy McGuinness is from Lancashire. You're from Liverpool, so you like brethren. <laughs> oh, a Lancashire and Liverpool in the same. Okay, anyway. So anyway, Paddy McGuinness told me two jokes. I didn't think they were that funny, but they might be funny. <laughs> I had an ex, Paddy McGuinness told me to tell you that I had an ex-boyfriend, he gave me a goose, ghost, <laughs> he gave me a ghost boomerang, I threw it away but it'll come back to haunt me. Oh. Hey. That's not my fault, it's Paddy McGuinness's fault. He also told me to tell you that another boyfriend of mine was a professional bungee jumper, he left me after a week but don't worry, I soon bounced back. <laughs> Don't worry, he's on tonight, as am I, so you made the right choice. <laughs> Danny Boy, another one. I've never heard of him before, but apparently he's been to Australia. He's very big in Australia. And um, he told me that the kangaroo is a very sacred animal in Australia. But I found out, I found out that thousands are killed every year. Apparently their feet are too big for the bicycles, the pedals. <laughs> You're giggling. You're giggling. Right, okay, so those are the professional comedians. So, what these two guys down here who are judging tonight's competition, Giuliano and Foxy, they gave me these jokes. This is Foxy's favourite joke. I'm sorry for the comedians, he's um, judging you tonight. Foxy's favourite joke is What's a shit suit? What's a shih tzu? What's a shih tzu? Do you know what a shih tzu is? It's a zoo with no animals. <laughs> it's not my joke. Anyway, I'm going to end with this one. Giuliano. What do you call a man with no arms? This is Jules' joke. What do you call a man with no arms? Oh, no. Shitty ass. Good night. <laughs>